Hey everyone, Mitch here at the NAB 2012 booth of PRG Lighting, and they have a new light, the True Color HS. I'm here with Trisha Moss from PRG. She's going to tell us what is the HS standing for. Ah, uh, well, there's um, a little known secret about that. Well, let's say the PC version is hyper soft. <laughs> hyper soft, but also like holy because it's really bright. Maybe. What? What is? Remote phosphor, it's remote phosphor technology. What's that mean? Phosphor, uh, easiest way to describe it is a deconstructed LED. There are two main components when you make LEDs. There's a blue pump and then there's a phosphor substrate. The phosphor is what gives it its white light tonality, tungsten, daylight, etc. We separate these two components, which is what makes the phosphor remote. Yeah. So the physically, you basically have a little tiny little blue, hyper blue LED, and then you have the phosphor material they normally pour on top of it. You've separated it away from it. Encapsulating it into one diode, we address each one of those components separately in these fixtures. Now, the advantage of doing that is? There's a number of them. Uh, we have a lot better consistency ratio because we're dealing with a larger sampling of the phosphors. So unit to unit, fixture to fixture, you're just bang on on consistency. Also, by separating it, we remove it from the heat source, which gives it a much longer lifetime. Also, because it's made to go in and go out, the fixture becomes upgradable and interchangeable. And as technology gets better, so do our phosphors. And you can just drop it right into the head. So the things you buy today, you can upgrade it for tomorrow and the next day. And we don't outdate. Terrific. So we're looking at this right now. It looks like a really bright light, but I understand this is dimmed way, way down. It is, the yeah. efficiency is what? It's about 10 to 1, actually. Uh, we're dealing with a 400 watt power supply, but we're competing with a 4,000 watt soft light. So very efficient, very yeah. bright light. Yeah, very efficient, very bright, very even field, too. No, right, because this entire panel is actually what is glowing, the phosphorescent panel. A lot of people have been asking me, is this a diffuser? It's actually the exact opposite of that. It's not a filter or a diffuser or anything. Cutting light, it's actually what's creating the light. And it's happening in an indiscriminate source. There's not a point that's being spread. Every side of this, whether it be the corners from the side or the corners from the middle, is illuminating in the same 180 degree fashion. So, not, so even compared to a light that did have a diffuser, there's no hot spot, there's no directionality to it. It is completely soft, yeah. even light. Now, this is daylight balanced, but then how would we make it tungsten balanced? It's really simple, actually. Um, pardon me. Uh, again, we use the phosphors, these remote phosphors that are interchangeable. So I'm going to do this really quickly. By just removing the side, and just drop this guy down. I'm going to tilt this up. And when I do this, you can see the blue element, that other elements of this light. Right. So it shows you really blue. blue. Yeah, exactly. So blue, phosphor, basic structure of our LED. Drop in another chemical balance, and boom. We now have tungsten. So the same can be done for any color temperature, really. So in theory, you could actually make uh, 4,500 degree or maybe a really, really warm candlelight, any, whatever you would want to see. Absolutely. Yeah, we're, we're in the process of getting the correct chemical balances with the adequate CRI because color rendering is very, very important to us. And that is our goal with this, is to make very usable color. And how accurate do we feel these colors are? Quite accurate. Uh, because we're dealing with a much larger surface area, we're dealing with a much more consistent sam sample population versus dealing with pin drops and little itty bitty bits where variations tend to stick out a little bit further. So right now with our tungsten, we're looking at a 97 CRI, which is huge. Um, on the daylight, daylight's actually a lot harder. So we're at 92, but we hope to get a little more effective on that. And when that happens, you don't need to buy a new fixture. It's just a simple upgrade of a phosphor panel. So you just slide one out and slide the new one out. Exactly, exactly. So you can keep up with technology without having to break the bank. Terrific. And the uh, and I guess if you break it, you can just slide it out and yeah. put a new one in too. Yeah. So shipping when? We are in manufacturing right now. We're doing pre-orders. So we see our first run coming in by early June, actually. And there's a number of dealers, Abel Synodec included, who have pre-ordered for us. So they're absolutely a fantastic source to get it from. Well, thank you very much. You heard it here first. PRG Lighting, the True Light HS from PRG and Able City.